hello guys welcome back to another ripple xrp news update we have amazing news for you currently the price of xrp is 91 cents down four percent within the day we are still down 15 percent within the week within the month and 11 percent within the week um uh, we are looking bearish today the whole of the day for xrp it's not a good thing but uh we should expect good things coming in the next uh, five to six days the price is not showing any signs as of yet but we will talk more on the matters of xrp price today we are going to look at news but first off let's look at metaverse and the metaverse is the next big investment theme and these are not my words these are words said by morgan stanley and we are going to look deep into this Now, investment bank Morgan Stanley has actually said that the metaverse is now the next big investment theme. And uh, he said this in a note directed to investors this Thursday. As you know, strategists from the bank believe this alternate conception of reality is amazing important interest for companies like Meta and Microsoft, which are already trying to grasp the concept. And of course, some of these companies are already capitalizing on it. As you all know, Meta is full throttle with this vision. And uh, Morgan Stanley, which is one of the biggest investment banks in the world, has announced it considers the metaverse the next big investment scheme. Of course, the metaverse is a concept that includes the construction of an alternate universe where individuals can model their image to whatever they want to be and perform real-life tasks such as buying things, gaming with friends, and other activities. And the concept, uh, the concept has actually already been grasped by companies that are trying to build their respective techs on it. And Facebook was renamed to Meta to actually reflect this new focus and Microsoft is also adding metaverse-themed uh, metaverse -themed elements to its products starting next year. Of course, Morgan Stanley strategist Edward Stanley declared that it can fundamentally change the medium through which we socialize with others. That is how big he thinks this is. And Morgan Stanley also said that more and more companies are moving into including these activities and elements in their projects and tech and gaming stocks are already making a profit from this new trend of the market including game universes like roblox and uh, morgan stanley actually stressed that news flow around the metaverse concept has been high and companies are embracing it in growing numbers and of any major theme companies and analysts have greater interest in the metaverse than any other theme at the time. Now, also, the note also acknowledged that we are still in the very early phases of this alternate world being built. And while all these initiatives are already starting to take shape, the complete metaverse is still years away and it will take considerably interpretation and collaboration from these companies for this world to exist. As you all know, this will be possible when users can move their experiences and avatars from one platform to another with no problem. Now, Morgan Stanley also noticed that most companies getting into the metaverse trend come from only three countries, the US, China and South Korea, these are the countries most focused on activities and corporate launches regarding the metaverse. Now, in other Ripple XRP news, Shark Tank star Kevin O'Leary says he has zero interest in investing in anything with litigation from the U.S. Securities and Exchange Commission. Yes, uh, Kevin actually says that... Um, he, uh, he actually explained that uh, he prefers to consult with the regulators regarding cryptocurrency. And this is in, in order to find out what's possible and what is not. So he's not uh, basically a risk taker. And um, with that, I regard him even lesser now hearing what he has to say. Because uh, you don't need the SEC to tell you what is good and what is not as far as Ripple XRP is concerned. The case is with the judges and we all know who is going to win. So you can definitely 
know that he will be losing a lots and lots of millions just for not betting or just for not buying ripple xrps now because of whatever the sec is saying but basically uh, as you all know the sec sued ripple and uh, it's uh, ceo brad galley house as well as its chairman chris larson over the sale of 1.3 billion hello guys thank you very much for watching this video if you've reached this far please do consider giving us a like because it does help us really a lot and also do consider subscribing for daily crypto news updates uh, on a 24-hour basis thank you very much for watching bye, -bye.